Thanks for joining me today. My name is Adam. I'm the brand manager here at Schedule, and I'm going to deliver a real quick video tip and trick for you today. And this tip was provided to me by Kate Rosen, who some of you may know. She's the manager of our client services group, so thanks a lot, Kate. Uh, this tip's really simple, but it will help you save a little bit of time. Um, I'm going to show you a few shortcuts to use when you're navigating the tree structure in the user preferences, user profiles, or system preferences areas. So we have a lot of options in there for you, so quick navigation will certainly help you save a little bit of time. Let's say I want to bump up the password security for my users uh, inside of Schedule, and I know this can be modified in the system preferences area of the supervisor options, I'm just not sure exactly where. So let's show you how to navigate quickly and find exactly what you're looking for. Let's go ahead and get to that area here. I'll click File, hover over Supervisor Options, hover on System Preferences, and click General. Click the System Options tab, which will show me all the listings here that I have the ability to, to modify. There's a lot of different options, as you can see, with this list. And as a default, the entire list is expanded when I land in this area. And the first little tip I'm going to show you here is how to expand and contract the entire list uh, using the numeric keypad. So, as I mentioned, as a default, the entire list is expanded. If you want to contract the entire list, you just hit the divide key on the numeric keypad. It looks like a forward slash. And that will contract uh, all the different categories. So you can take a look and look at this list here. And if you want to expand, you hit the multiplication key, which is the star key on the numeric keypad as well. So contract, expand, and with the entire list expanded, if you know what you're looking for, you can just go ahead and start typing, and it'll bring you to that uh, specific line item that has that word appearing in there somewhere. And in order to move to the next option, you can hit F3, and that will take you down to uh, help you find exactly what you're looking for, which here I can see password options is what I was looking for. And let's say I wanted to change the minimum length for the user password from 3 to, say, 7. In order to make it a little bit more secure, I can, I can do that there. And another little tip on navigating in this area is if you have everything contracted, and instead of expanding the entire list by using the multiplication key, uh, if you want to just expand one category, you can use the plus key on the uh, numeric keypad. You can see it's just expanding one at a time as opposed to the entire list. Uh, and the minus sign will contract just that individual. So plus and minus are for the individuals, and multiplication and divide are for the uh, entire list. So hope that helped you. Uh, might help you save a little bit of time. And that's it for right now. Thanks for joining me for this quick schedule tip and trick. If you have your own that you'd like to submit, feel free to add them in the comments area of our tip and trick blog posts at schedulealblog.com. We'd love to hear what you have to say. Or you can uh, post them on our Facebook page at facebook.com schedule. So thanks again for joining me.